Hey friends, today in this video we are going to talk about how to install MSBI step by step. Yes, in our learn MSBI step by step video series, we are going to see, we are going to understand to install MSBI step by step. This is Gurunath Adogi from onlinebuff.com. Let's get started. So hey friends, in order to install MSBI in our PC or laptop or desktop, we need this five setups that is let me just show you in my notepad that is let me open up my notepad yes we need visual studio a visual studio version can be anything 2017 or 2019 or 2019 then we need a sql server a sql server then we need to manage a sql server we need a sql server management studio a sql server management studio yes then we need sshdt that is sql server data tools for integration services and for analytical services so i will just write sshdt and finally ssrs setup for reporting service yes for integration service and for analytical service, we need SSDT that is uh, SQL Server Data Tools and for reporting services, we need SSRS setup. So these are the five setups we need in order to uh, to run MSBI in our laptop or uh, desktop or in our PC, you know. So these five uh, setups must, you know, in order to make it MSBI functional. So let's go and install uh, step by step all these five setups so first i am going to install visual studio 2019 yes since we are in in 2019 so definitely i am going to install download and install visual studio 2019 so let's get started with the installation so let's go and start the process of installing visual studio 2019 so in order to uh, install we need to download the visual studio setup so in order to download i'm going into my mozilla Fire firefox browser where in the where i'm going to type download visual studio 2019 yes so this is the link to download visual studio 2019 so the download link will be provided in the description of this video so don't worry about the link okay so just concentrate on the how the installation process is there right now so here i'm going to download the community version the free version of visual studio so let me click on the community version so i just click on the community version so here we go so my file is been downloaded so as you can see friends you know the i have just downloaded the setup file of visual studio the the file size is just 1 mb you know so once you ran this file the installer automatically uh, downloads and automatically at the same time it installs the setup so i'm just i'm just going to click on this visual studio setup that is installer setup exe file so as you can see installer is running do you want allow this app to make changes to your device? Yes. I am just going to close the few things as you can see. Continue. Oh, yes. So the download process just started as you can see. So it will take some time, you know, to download the Visual Studio. I think uh, I can just confirm the time of download. I can confirm the size of this download process once only after the download process get completes. So let's wait and watch what happens. So download is completed. So now installation process is going on. I think it is just downloading the Windows installer. Uh, I'm sorry, Visual Studio installer. So after that, the download process will start for Visual Studio 2019. As you can see, almost done, you know. So in order to download the Visual Studio, your internet speed should be very good, you know. Uh, I think almost, I think two Mbps, it's it's okay. 
you know if you have the 2 mbps or 1 mbps speed you know then it is okay to download visual studio at your home only or else you can just download wherever the speed is good you can download the setup and bring back that setup to your home and just install it you know you can do that also but uh, since my internet speed is good here so i'm just downloading online only so almost done as you can see yes so installer has been opened here i want what i want from here i want asp.net and web development i want node just development and i want yes dotnet desktop environment that is my windows form console application of using the c sharp visual basics and f sharp and uh, i don't want anything i think that's about it so as you can see the total space it is showing me 72 gb as you can see friends here the total space required to download whatever i have selected here you know if i uncheck this you know i think my space going to get reduced yes 7.18 if i check this it it will increase yes so whatever we check here you know depending on that the total space increases here you know so what what i want to do now next you know i want to install while downloading so i will just say install now so i have selected asp.net web development i have selected dotnet desktop de development and i have selected node js development so this is my requirement you know yeah, your your requirement can can differ to my requirement but uh, in order to do the proper installation you can select whatever i have selected you know yes you can you can omit for uh, node js development it is not necessary but uh, yes i have selected like that only so let's go and install while downloading so let me just click on the install button here okay so my installation process has started it is 7 gb you know as you can see the speed of my internet it is showing me 3 mbps per second so i think it will take quite some time you know so i'm going to just stop my video right now here and i'm going to resume it once it's done okay the download process is done hey friends as you can see we have successfully installed the visual studio 2019 as you can see so visual studio is been installed successfully so as you can see we have just downloaded the complete visual studio and installed it as you can see it has been installed here so so first step the first process of installing visual studio 2019 is completed now we will go and install sql server 2017 hey friends to decrease the length of this video we have divided this video into the different parts the part one video of installing visual studio 2017 or 2019 is completed now we will continue the sql server installation process in part two video so stay with us in the part two video also and continue with the installation process of msbi step by step visual studio 2019 download link will be provided in the description box of this video and if you have any doubts or queries regarding this installation of visual studio 2019 do comment me in the comment section below of this video and if you really like this video uh, do not forget to give the big fat thumbs up and if you want to learn more msbi step by step then do subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated with my latest updated videos so thank you very much and see you on the part 2 video.